Hello again and welcome back to Fallout 76. Thank you so much for joining me again. We are, where are we? We're right here by this place called Solomon's Pond, a place that we visited in the last episode. Uh, we found a uh, responder corpse body down here somewhere. And um, I think here's where we found it. And uh, he had some kind of scavenger note on him and uh, we were supposed to go here and pick up some pipe. And the pipe turned out to be a pipe weapon. So it's just kind of like uh, something that took us out of our way. Uh, nothing important, really. But uh, that's okay. It's no big deal. No big deal. What are we doing now? Well, we want to um, go to Golly Mine. That's what we want to do. Not here. Oh, no. Interesting. This is Golly Mine. Um, okay, so there's Golly Mine and Golly Mine Exit. The quest that we're doing is... Duchess said she's willing to tell me what she knows about Crane and his treasure. I just need to follow her. We're supposed to find Crane's treasure. If we show that on the map... There, it's there now. It wasn't there just a moment ago. So, this is the direction I need to go in. I need to go this way. Uh, I mean, I could try to just walk in a straight line, but I'm going to come across these mountains and I might not be able to get around them. So, it may make more sense if we just walk towards here in front of White Spring, and then took these roads up. Got on this side, took this road up there. We're gonna try to do that in this episode. Another episode of just walking along and enjoying the beautiful West Virginia countryside. And seeing what there is to see. It's fun seeing what's out here. Uh, right here is um, a place called Vantage, I believe, that uh, is now a freaking um, raider camp, and I and I cleared it out last episode. Uh, it's probably going to re be repopulated this episode, but maybe not. Maybe I'll get lucky here and I won't have to deal with it again. That would be nice if I didn't. Yeah, it's seeming, seeming to be pretty quiet. Don't hear anybody playing the banjo. So that's kind of nice. Now we got mountains that we need to get down here. Boy, do we ever. Uh, so, you know, we could always just like put on our... Uh, our armor suit, our power armor suit, hop into it and uh, just jump down. Because uh, you can't be killed in power armor. It's not possible. Okay, you can be killed, but not from far. You can jump as far as you want, as high as you want. And that is what I mainly use my power armor for. What do you say? What do you say we do some jumping here? There's White Spring down there. Here we go. Whee! Nice. Man, ain't no mountains gonna stand in my way. I need the opposite, though. I need uh, jetpacks. So, like, if I'm going in the opposite direction, I can go up. Uh, I... You know... For some reason, I thought that there were jetpacks in this game, but I have never seen another player uh, in jetpacks. So I don't know whether such a thing exists or not. But it uh, might be something worth looking into one of these days. I don't know. What was that? Like thunder or... I'm so glad I oh, goody. Good lord. You. Go away. Congratulations. Yeah, yeah. Today is your lucky mm -hmm. day. Yep. You've won the great Appalachian sweepstakes. Oh, I'm so excited. And this wonderful prize yeah. is yours. Okay, great, thank you. We at so, the great Appalachian sweepstakes appreciate your continued purchases and subscriptions. However, we would like to remind you that your bill in the amount of $73,428.66 is overdue. Mm -hmm. And prompt payment is appreciated. Yep. Have a great day. Thanks. <laughs> I wanted his lead. I can't believe how easy he was to kill. <laughs> uh, anyway, so that's the, at least the second time we've run into that guy here. And uh, last time, he gave me some kind of certificate. And I thought it was CAS, but I've been told that it was actually GAS. Uh, so let's go down here and find that thing. Let's see what it was that he gave us last time. This time he gave us a pocket watch. There we go. Look, I've already got several of these. Uh, it says, uh, Congratulations, winner of the Great Appalachia Sweepstakes. We are pleased to inform you that you have won the third prize. A year's supply of cram. 
Allow between 16 to 52 weeks for prize delivery. Great Appalachia Sweepstakes Incorporated is not responsible for storage and delivery fees for prizes over five pounds. By accepting these certificates, winner agrees to pay all storage fees until delivery confirmation is re received. I tried to read real fast. Over here, we've got ourselves a good old diseased, rotting, feral ghoul. Disgusting. He must die. So it was just all beautiful just a moment ago. Everything was nice and green and lush. And now it's all gray and brown and rainy. And I am sad because I like it when it's all green and lush. But it can't be green and lush without rain, so it's a life lesson there. You take the good with the bad. Hello, squirrel. So we're just going to cruise on past White Spring here. I have no desire whatsoever to go in. And uh, I think so long as we stay over here on the golf course, I think we should be okay. I don't think we're going to see too much resistance. I don't think so anyway. I must say the golf course looks different than I remembered. I don't remember the grass being this tall. Huh, interesting. Who's that? Fritz. Let's go talk to Fritz. Who's Fritz? How's it going, Fritz? What's up, man? Oh, he's ready to golf. Look at him. He's got his golf outfit on. Hello, Fritz. How are you? I can't hear you. I'm rich. <laughs> I can't hear you. I'm rich. Well, if it isn't one of those young punks who keeps trampling on my golf course. Oh, my. What do you have to say for yourself, kid? Uh, kid? Are you old enough to be saying that? Or sorry about that, I'll be more careful in the future, or I'll tread where I want, when I want. I kind of want to say that, but let's use our perception. Why, I don't know what you're talking about. Kids these days, so presumptuous. Uh-huh, so, uh, what's your story, Gramps? Well, it's funny you ask. I was just thinking about the good old days when I could shoot birdies out on the lawn without getting mauled by ferals. Ah, those were the simple days. Just playing golf and happily ignoring all the problems in the world. Sounds wonderful. Uh, love your little get up. Did you loot it off some bodies around here? Get up? Well, I never. <sighs> all right, you got me. <laughs> I'm a raider who's got nothing better to do, okay? I spend my days fending off irradiated monstrosities to survive. Anyway, why not make some fun out of it? Why not? Okay, so you're a raider. Do you really like golfing? It's my favorite hobby. <laughs> now, these days, it's hard to find a quality golf ball, so I aim for ghoul heads instead. Normally, it takes a couple strokes to knock those stubborn suckers off their tees, but next time, I'm shooting for a hole in one. All right, let's talk about something else. Certainly. Mm, so, what is this place? This mighty fine establishment is the one and only White Spring Resort, where only millionaires are welcome. If you're a helpless youth with no assets to your name and nowhere else to go, well, that's too bad. Get lost. <laughs> That guy had a lot of fun with this. Uh, do you have something against the White Spring? Does anyone still live here? Does money and social class really matter anymore? Why, of course it does. In a world like this, banding together is necessary for survival. But it wouldn't do to shack up with just any old ragamuffins waving guns around and wearing scraps for clothing. I am, of course, cut from a finer cloth. This dapper clothing and refined accent serve to set that standard for the new world. That is a rather refined accent you have, sir. Does anyone still live here? Not anymore. Apparently the robots booted all the guests to the curb for some pre-scheduled renovations. Suddenly they were forced to brave the wasteland just like the rest of us. Ha! <laughs> I mean... What a shame the most admirable upper class suffered such a tragic injustice. What a shame indeed. So do you have something against this place, dude? Whatever do you mean? 
How can I possibly have any complaints with a, a luxurious top floor view of the apocalypse and a shining <laughs> silver spoon up my ass? I simply love to sip tea and watch the peasants die of radiation poisoning. Okay, let's talk about something else. Sure thing, kiddo. What do you want to know? Mm, I'll be going now. Happy golfing. To you as well, stranger. Thank you. Thank you, Fritz. It was nice meeting you. Thank you. Man, you just come out here, you just want to do some golfing, and then there's stupid vertibots flying over top of you. That's just great. That's just great. No peace and quiet. I tell you what, man. Okay, let's keep moving in this direction towards this marker that I placed. Yes, beautiful, beautiful indeed. Look at this, these things cast in shadows over me. Can't even gulf in private. Is there something behind this tree? What is this, is something on the tree? Okay, <laughs> what the heck happened here? <laughs> All right, that's interesting. Look at the shadows, man. That's pretty cool, really. Wait a minute. Fine crane, fine crane treasure. What? Well, that's odd. It's telling me it's like ninety-eight paces ahead of me. That's strange. Let's see what happens when we get up here. How's it going? This is an active work site. Guests are advised to stand Ooh, look at this. clear. <laughs> okay. Oh, charging up over there, it sounds like. What is going on? Oh, what the... Oh, look at this! What the hell? Okay, this is odd. I just happened to stumble upon this. I mean, really. Because if you look at this quest... And you look at the map... It tells you to go here to Golly Mine. I'm way I'm here. How did I get so lucky that I would just stumble ac across this? All right, that is bizarre. All right, let's go into the deep. What the hell's going on, man? This is very strange. The deep. Oh my. Well, let's see here. Okay. I don't know what's going on, man. Is this really related to Crane's treasure? I don't know. A fever blossom. Sure, why not? Okay, well, I harvested a different herb. Ooh. What's this? I can't seem to harvest it. It's too bad. Do I have a map of this place? No, I do not. No map. Does this go anywhere? Fever Blossom. Oh, hey! Oh. Cave Crickets. Why did it have to be Cave Crickets? Oh! Gross. Those things just give me the, the heebiest of jeebies. Why do I want Brain Fungus? Well, let's see where this takes us. I'm starting to think that maybe I should have taken that side path back there a while back, but We'll go here, here and see which way this takes us, where, where we end up. I think I hear another cave cricket. Hey, how's it going? Golly, five hits. It's too many hits, man. That's way too many hits. More fungus for the brain. Get us a little bit of glowing fungus here. Look at this. What's this place? Got a body here. What the hell? What in the world? What in the world is this place? What the hell? That is bizarre. 
Wow. Wow, okay, this is exciting. What in the world have we stumbled upon? I don't think this is related to Crane's treasure. I don't think it is, but we're gonna find out, hopefully. Man, these things even fight back? It's like he's just letting me hit him. Not complaining. Oh my gosh, there's another path that way. I'm gonna get freaking lost in this place. Oh, great. There's no map for this place, man. I wanna get lost. It's just stuff floating around in here. What in the world? This is really neat. What in the world? What game am I playing? <laughs> well, I mean, I'm collecting a lot of Fever Blossom. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but... Hey, there. Well, this one's taking a few hits. Probably because he saw me. I didn't sneak up on him. Go, he's laying. Starlight Creeper. What's this thing? What the hell is that? Oh my. Sitting here curled around a lantern. Well, I don't know what the hell that thing is or was, but I'm glad it's dead. The heck? This keeps on going, man. Oh, he's so lost. Okay. I guess this is the way I came from because I can't pick up those plants anymore. Alright. Yeesh. Uh, looks like maybe I need a little bit of food, so let's take care of that real quick. Some aid here. Let's see, what kind of stuff can I eat that's about ready to spoil? Grilled rad roach. We don't want that to go to waste. Mm -mm. Waste not, want not. Mole rat. Oh, crap. <laughs> I accidentally ate mole rat chunks. I shouldn't have eaten that. Those aren't cooked yet, I don't think. Right? Mole rat chunks? I don't remember. Mole mutt chops. There we go. Now I'm all full of delicious food. And I'm going to take a drink. All right, back to this creepy thing. Let's keep on going. I don't know, man. We'll just pick a direction and go. Where are we now? Oh, look at this. Toxic water. Well, yeah. getting a serious amount of radiation here. Oh my, this could be bad. This could be bad. Oh, great. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna die down here because I don't know where the hell I am. Oh gosh, it's a dead end. Moving in dirty water. Give me a disease. Oh. Oh! Oh, I forgot that I need to breathe. <laughs> Oopsies. <laughs> uh, let's see, where did it put me? It put me... Where the hell am I? I guess I'm here at the entrance of this place again. Oh, that's okay. Huh, that's weird. So, let's go this way this time. Whoa. Whoa. What the hell? Oh, hey, how's it going, guys? Dude, those are some high-level liberators, man. I don't know if I've ever seen Liberators that high of a level before. Hmm. What's up? What's up, guys? What the? What's that? What was that? Something is shooting. Oh, man. Hmm, well. Interesting. I'm still very much irradiated. Why am I getting plus 30 rads? Speaking Chinese. Better take some health, huh? What the 
hell is going on down here? Better take some more health. More rat away. A communist soldier. This guy. Suffering food loss from parasites, apparently. I'm gonna take your 556 five, rounds. What? This guy's invisible. Look at that. He doesn't have a head. That's a pretty neat trick. <laughs> this game, I tell you, man. Still says danger. Look at that. A couple communist soldiers down there. Uh, let's try to just hit him in the torso. We don't need to get all cute. Okay, nice try, dude. Mm, I'll take the gunpowder. Somebody else still shooting at me. You guys think you're so tough. What the heck is going on, man? This is neat. Where am I on the map now? Still just kind of hanging around here. I'll retrieve my dropped loot. <laughs> Good luck retrieving my dropped loot. It's in a freaking cave. A flooded cave. I mean, I don't care. I don't know if I care about my dropped loot, to tell you the truth. I don't think it was that long ago that I stored my stuff in a stash. And, you know, so I missed some things. Big deal. I got a ton of stuff, man. It's good to be rich. Look at this place. What do we got on the ground here? 45 rounds. Nice. Exactly what I wanted. Cool. <laughs> What in the world have I stumbled upon? Literally stumbled upon. I mean, this is probably part of a quest later in the game, but we're here now. We ain't going anywhere. We're gonna, we're gonna check this place out, man. Check it out. The deep. Well, it says I could open the door. I'm surprised. I thought that it was going to be um, locked or something. But it's not. Picking up all this fever blossom. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. It's just pretty. So I like to collect it. Probably don't want to go down there. It's probably death, right? I would imagine. Alright, before we go in, let's kind of walk around the place. Definitely hear people walking around in there. More of this uh, Fever Blossom stuff. Fever Blossom. Fever Blossom. I mean, I don't know. Fever Blossom, it's pretty. Don't know what I'm going to do with it, but there it is. Oh, weird. Don't know what just happened there. Construction equipment here. Oh, I fell down inside of it. Oh, communist commander. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I didn't quite catch that dude. <laughs> oh, hey, here's another one. Look at this. Hit killing level 66 dudes in one try. How do you like that? How do you like that? This... Ooh, anybody understand what she's saying? I most certainly do not, but I'd like to know what she's saying. I doubt she's saying, hello, welcome to the deep. We're happy to have you here. I'm pretty sure that's not what's going on. I mean, I could be wrong, but... Oh, this communist soldier is a ghoul. Hmm, interesting. This is really neat. What is going to be in this place, man? So yes, I know I'm suffering food loss from parasites, but I'm not worried about it. I got plenty of food. I got more food than I got disease cures, so we're just going to we're just going to try to stick it out, man. 
We'll see how that works out for us. I, um... I can't stop myself. I do not need these fever blossoms. I am just picking them up. They're just going to go bad. And, um... I will forget all about them. Here's a little box here. It's got a stem pack in it. I must have just totally missed that box. Let's uh, climb up this ladder over here before we go in the front door and see what t where this takes us. Because it's fun to explore. Okay. All right. Let's keep going up. Okay. Hmm. All right. I don't need no stinking ladder. I can jump high. Well, I mean, not really seeing any reason to come up here. There's no secret door or anything. And I cannot get on the top of this place. No, sir, I cannot. So, I'm not real sure why they built the, the stairs. Really. Unless there's like a door down here or something that I didn't see, but I don't think there is. Alright, well, let's go back down. We'll go in that front door. We'll check that out. Sounds like fun, right? Sounds like there's quite a few people walking around inside of there. Alright, around the corner and in the front door. Me and my 999 plus ammo. I think we'll be okay. Alright. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Sorry to ruin your day. Golly, man, they are dying messily. Ooh, that was cool sounding. Oh my gosh, these guys are no match for me and my gun. No match. Alright. What are they doing? Just walking around in here, going up and down stairs with no destination? Just getting their exercise in? Oh, what do we got here? Um, I'll take the... That... I can't remember whether plasma cartridges are the things that sell or not. I think they are. I think those sell sometimes. People buy those from vending machines occasionally, I think. Fusion core is already missing. Makes me wonder if somebody's already been here. Oh, this goes down as well as up. I don't want any of that crap. I don't need no stealth, boy. I come in guns blazing, man. Actually, that's not true. Stealth is a very important part of my strategy. Interesting. So they just got some toilets over here? They couldn't they couldn't build a, a wall? They couldn't build a room? They just had to put up a curtain for the toilets? What the hell kind of place is this? Iguana bits. Oh, okay, a little gathering place here. Let's go up before we go down. What do you say? Security terminal. Seems kind of cool. Let's see what's in the security terminal. Let's see what's going on. What's going on? What is this place? Am I even going to be able to read it? Is it going to be in Chinese? Why is this not in Chinese? <laughs> Display setting, English, U.S. Motherload Acquisition Facility, Security Station, Hail the People's Republic. Notice all personnel. To all personnel, initiate facility data wipe procedures. American infiltration detected. Proceed with Operation Piercing Viper. That sounds cool. Security procedures. Oh, I think that was my stomach making a noise. I better eat something. I don't want to kill over dead for some dumb reason. Uh, let's see, what can we eat? Something that's about to spoil. Here we go. Uh, mole rat. I can't remember where there are mole rat chunks. I think these are okay, right? Because they don't have a disease chance, so I think those are cooked. What else do I have? Roast mega sloth. Well, we don't want that mega sloth to go to waste.
A sweet roll? Sure. And um, we'll have um, some sugar bombs for dessert. And then we'll drink some water. Okay, we're good. All right, back to the terminal. Security procedures. Facility security procedures one. All personnel should openly display a facility ID badge at all times. Failure to do so will be met with deadly force. Two. No unauthorized entry slash exit from this facility without direct written consent consent from the director. Any unscheduled access to the facility entrance will be met with deadly force by people walking up and down stairs. This includes base personnel without explicit permission to exit or enter the facility. 3. All personnel are subject to search of their person and personal effects at all times. Possession of any unauthorized contraband will result in application of deadly force. 4. If possible, detain and interrogate subjects before applying deadly force in order to obtain any relevant counterintelligence. That's a long word. Interrogation should last no more than 12 hours before subject termination. And then we've got tunnel status. Tunnel 1, Mountains North active. Tunnel 2, Mountains Central active. Tunnel 3, Mountains South active. Tunnel 4, Meyer, active. Tunnel 5, redacted, dig in progress. So there's a tunnel in the north, central, and south mountains, and one in the Meyer. Would you say we're in the south mountains right now? I think that's where we are right now, right? We look at the map. I mean, I guess it could be, this could be central mountains, maybe. It's hard to say, really, if they consider this central or south. Interesting. And this is just, that's just not marked on my map. It's so bizarre. Okay, I want to go up first. <laughs> Another headless communist soldier. What the hell's going on? Got some computer equipment up here. Who knows what kind of work people were doing up here once upon a time. Nobody knows, really. I don't know. I mean, there's a lot of the stuff that I have marked for search, but... I'm not really interested in picking stuff up. I just want to explore. What's going on up here? Let's unlock the first aid box. It's good to have first aid. Oh yeah. Desk fan. I gotta have that. It's warm in here. It's kinda stuffy. Medex? Okay. Uh, fusion cells, snack cakes, and I don't care about that crap. Hazmat suit, I don't care about that. Looks like a barracks, maybe. Right? Kind of. I don't care about those mods. Well, uh, this is the top floor. No real explanation as to what's going on here. All right, let's um, let's go down. That was a neat sound. Auxiliary control room and a door that requires a key. Hmm. Well, I guess we're going to go into the auxiliary control room first, since um, only PRC motherload access key can unlock. And nobody bothered to just leave the key lying around for me to pick up? The nerve. Well, let's go into the auxiliary control room. This is a different area to load here. This is interesting. This is it? This is the whole room? Why did this have to be a whole new load?
What does that say? Oh, yeah. What in the world? Huh. Well, um... I mean, normally when, you know, the game loads a whole new area, it's because it's a big area. Um, or in this case, maybe this is a, my own instance, but I don't see the significance of this room at all. It's just a quiet room. This is freaking bizarre. Well, I'm kind of at a dead end now. Uh, I guess I could go back and look for the key. There's no guarantee that the key is even in this facility. Might be something that we have to find someplace else. Fascinating. Hmm. Well, I mean, you guys are pretty eagle-eyed. Please let me know if you saw me walk past the key without noticing it. it sounds like... Even if I get through that door, there's going to be a force field beyond it. So... I mean, I guess I could just take another quick look around here. See if there's a key line anywhere that I missed. It wasn't in the terminal. Right? Where would the key be? Maybe on a person's body. But I'm pretty sure I checked all the bodies that I dispatched. I mean, it could be somewhere out in those tunnels, but that doesn't really make sense for it to be out there. Hmm. I mean, it's hard to say where it would be. Oh, there's purified water there. Not up there. Did somebody dropped the key when they were going to the bathroom? I don't see it. Is it another plunger? Nope. Not another plunger. Could have been. Maybe it's in this toolbox. Take off my concentrated fire. Put on a pick lock. Get to picking. Surprised that worked. Uh, I don't want any of that crap. No. One of these days I'll have to get serious about deciding what to do with those perks, but right now, I don't care. Duffel bag over here that I did miss. No, I didn't. No, I did look at that duffel bag. Little bobby pin box. It's kind of cool. Hmm. Well, let's um let's take another look upstairs. Just to uh, really be super annoyingly thorough. More water that I missed before. Well, I'm not seeing it. <laughs> so, I mean, like I said before, I'm pretty sure that there's going to be a quest at some point in the game that sends us here. So we're probably going to have to come back here and re-explore this place anyway. Luckily, it wasn't too difficult to clear out and make our way through. So when we come back, it won't be too much work. Uh, but boy, it sure is interesting. Um, just a nice random thing to stumble across. And as far as I can tell, there's more tunnels out here to look, look in. Caves or whatever you want to call them. Um... So let's head back out to those caves, I guess. I 
I mean, I guess I could try to go back and retrieve my loot. There's that uh, opening that we saw before. Where we picked up that buff out. You know what I'm talking about. Don't want any of that. Okay. Let's, um... Let's just look around here some more, man. I mean... Let's see what else there is to see. Let's go a different way this time. Maybe... Maybe we'll see where the game put my loot. See if I can pick it up. Might be interesting. Here's that opening that we saw. The body here. And when we came in, these things were like shooting... Or they explode... They were exploding or something, remember? Fascinating. So, if you know what this place is, don't tell me, okay? Let me find out on my own. Unless it is something that I just flat out missed. But, uh, yeah, let me explore this on my own. Figure this one out. I don't remember which way I went last time. I think I did go this way, didn't I? Kind of trying to head back. Yeah, we've been in here. Let's go see if I can't get my loot back. I mean, we might as well since I'm here. Let's see what the game... If the game was generous and put the loot in a place I could retrieve it. No, it looks like it put it underwater, doesn't it? Hmm. All right, before we get in this water, let me take some rad X. I'm gonna take some rad away. Crap. Um, actually, I forget. One of these, I can't remember. One of these will um, negate my mutations, but not forever. Just for a while, right? Is that right? Um, crap, I can't remember. Hmm. I don't know if it matters, but it is nice to be able to jump. How do I go up? Man, I'm starting to think that this might be a mistake coming down here again. Here's my loot, just floating. Take all. Let's get the hell out of here, man. Yeah, I don't need to be going in there. That is craziness. That is crazy. Maybe if I knew where I was going, and if I knew it had an end, um, and there may even be a perk or something that I could get with it that would help me in there. Maybe. Um, isn't there something that like helps you breathe underwater or something? So maybe if I had that, I might go in there, but um, instead we're gonna go back this way. We're gonna go the other way this time. So we came from there. Let's see where this takes us. Oh, it comes to a dead end. We found ourselves an ammo box stuck on it. Fine, I'll open the perk back. We get gunsmith, can do, slow metabolizer, EMT. The funny's best way to have a clean conscious? Never use it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, remove concentrated fire. Put uh, expert pick lock on here. Let's see what's inside of this ammo box. It better be good. Especially now that I broke my freaking um, bobby pin. Well, that's it. That is it. So, um, that is the end of the cave. The only other way to go is down there where the water was, but like I said, I mean, I could look in my perks, but. There's one that lets me breathe underwater or something. I mean, I have seven points to spend, but I wasn't really planning on getting the one that allows me to breathe underwater. And um, there's no guarantee that I'm even going to notice it when I scroll through here. Because uh, I don't remember the name of it. I'm just hoping that as I scroll through, I'll be like, oh yeah, that's it. Um, 
mean, I thought it was called like Aqua Boy or something, but I didn't see that in the A's. And did they add new perks to the game? Because some of these don't seem familiar to me. Not that I have them all memorized, but... No, that's from drinking. Yeah, some of these look new. Boy, we got a long way to go. There's Mysterious Stranger and Mysterious Savior. <laughs> well, what the hell? Now, why is this B way back here in the middle of the O's? <laughs> the hell game. Um, boy, I did not realize I had so many of these. Holy cow. My goodness. Radical. Nope. Well. My goodness gracious. Holy cow. There's super duper. It's been suggested I get this. 10% chance that I'll get double the results. That would be good for crafting weaponry, maybe. Hmm. Well, um, yeah, there's an F in here in the T's. <laughs> the hell game. Yeah, no, but there's a B down here. These are now in random order, it appears. Well, I never did see the one that Apparently makes it so that I could swim. But that's okay. No big deal. No big deal. Nobody cares. Well, this was not part of Crane's treasure. I don't know why the game was telling me to come down here for the Crane's treasure quest. Just another strange thing in the strange things we've found in this game thus far. There's been a few. Okay, I got a ch challenge complete for harvesting wild fun guy. This will take us back out to Appalachia. Out, back out to Appalachia we go. So that was a really, really interesting detour. Brings up more questions than answers, that's for sure. But like I said, if you know what it is, don't tell me. Let me find out on my own. Unless I missed something, you can you can tell me that. If I missed the key, let me know. Okay, well, there we go. I'm going to end this episode here. When we come back next time, we will uh, continue on our way, as I plan to do. This is so bizarre. If I turn this off, then... It doesn't show this as the quest location, but if I turn it back on, then it does. <laughs> so, but it's not on the map. On the map, it's in Gully Mine. Golly. All right, well, more mysteries. Mysteries are cool. I'm okay with mysteries, so long as they finally get solved. Thanks for joining me on this episode, everybody. Hope you had fun. If you did, why don't you let me know, leave me a like or a comment. If you're not a subscriber, why not subscribe and click the bell so you're notified whenever I post a video. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you again in the next episode.